Let me do it. Let me do a quick race over here. Check out somebody's uh, track. We're going to use that. Check out community tracks. These are tracks people just made. Hey, there is Mark. Cars and collectibles are in my eBay store. If you get a chance, check them out. Oh, fun. With checkpoints. Good job. Test track. Uh, -da -ba -da. I don't know if that's a 20 seconds. You should try to make your tracks 20 seconds long so that people get coins for multiplayer. Stove top. I, I guess where that track goes. Oh, maybe you start on the stove. Let's do it real fast. I did a couple tracks on my Team Grooves account called Earthquake Drill. And uh, it's just like an earthquake drill. You start someplace. Uh, the track's like an earthquake. So after you go through the checkpoint, you need to head under a table, right? That's what you do in an earthquake. You want to uh, get yourself under a table or a desk. <coughs> and people have had plenty of time to race them. Which way are we facing? So I got to go to the right. Oh, I can't see my timer. Oh, well. Interesting. And the finish line, I think, was over there. Okay, here we go. Let's do it again. Restart left. Left. I know I got to be on the left, right? <laughs> Otherwise, we hit whatever's on top of the, uh, the stove. What happened? I turned to look real fast. Oh, I hit the top. Okay. I can see on the stream. So it shows shows me over there. Let's go ahead and I'm going to search for earthquake. You don't have to search for earthquake drill. Just search earthquake. So earthquake drill. And you see how I have all those invisible tracks? That's to try to make it uh, so that the game thinks the track's longer than it actually is. Let me add that to favors. I'm going to do it. Here's the other one I did. So I did one in college. So you have to get under one of the desks. And then uh, this one here is in the basement. Get under the kitchen table. See the uh, track going like this? So it's an earthquake. Whoa! Earthquake! That's yeah, a gimmick. I know. Other people made tracks. Earthquake, earthquake, just looks like a regular track. I like, I like how I at least made a theme of it, right? Here we go. I can go ahead and take this out of uh, my favorites because we're going to race it right now. <clears throat> I made these on my Team Grooves account. <clears throat> And if you try to get off the track too soon before the checkpoint, uh, it's going to let you know you missed the checkpoint. So see, it's under the desk down there. And these shots are from the invisible track. See right there? If you try to cut too soon. It'll say, uh, as soon as you touch the invisible track, it'll say checkpoint warning. The other thing is that uh, I'm going to go ahead and get off now just to show you something. If people do use the map, see, if they use the map down there in the corner, they're going to come this way. They're going to try to follow the map and see how the thing goes through here. And then you're going to think, how am I supposed to follow that? Well, the invisible track goes through the bookcase. Really, you want to come around. And then I hit it right there. But uh, watch, I didn't, I didn't do the checkpoint, so watch it. Oh, there it goes. Checkpoint. Let me go ahead and move my camera. So that person did it in 20 seconds. Let's see if I could do it faster. I don't know. I have not raced this before. This is the first time I ever raced it. I, I did the track. I validated it. You don't have to go all the way to the end, right? As soon as you can get off, get off.
I'll let him keep the high score. Oh! I went too far. I was going to try to stop right there. Oh, well. You can do it faster. But because of all that invisible track, it's going to think it's more than 20 seconds long. This is the other one in the basement. And I took the invisible track and I did the loops above the table over there. So this way you don't even touch the invisible track. No checkpoint. Uh, there is a checkpoint on this straightaway, actually. Uh, I don't think anybody even raced it, did they? If I see somebody uh, go... Uh, if I see a shadow, then I know somebody did. Oh yeah, look, 19 seconds. Whoa! Whoa! Don't land in the bush. That's not good. So, I beat the tank. But you can do better than that. You can do better than that, for sure. Okay, let's see what I got new cars in the shop. Here we go. See, now it started over. Bump around. Don't have it. <gasps> I see super treasure. Off duty. Don't have it. Skull Crusher. Got it. Exotic. Got it. Bad as a blade. Got it. Monosaurus. Already got it. Twin mill. Uh, this is a super treasure hunt. See how it's only 500 coins? Look. Oh, I can't see the points. 1,200, 1,200, 1,200, 1,200. Normally this one's 2,000. It's only 500. That's a super treasure hunt. I can press triangle for preview. It's in the bottom. There you go. Ooh, super treasure hunt. So shiny. And look at those rubber tires. Nice. Let's go ahead and buy that. So now just make sure. Okay, I got everything that I can buy. Uh, let's go to my collection. And I could press filter, the touchpad. And rarity, if I push over, it says super treasure hunt. It says there's 11. There's 11 super treasure hunts in the game. Let's go ahead and apply and exit. I only found three so far on this account. That There's the Fiat 500. There's Street Creeper. And... The Twin Mill Super Treasure Hunt that I just got. I need eight more. Don't forget, check out my eBay store. Thanks for watching. Happy collecting. Happy racing. Bye-bye.